viewers and subscribers, and welcome back to another show with the old video gamer. And I am playing Don't Knock Twice. And I got this on sale. Like I usually buy games, I buy games on sale practically almost all the time. So I probably don't need to say that when I say I picked up a new game. You, if you've watched any of my videos, you probably know that by now. But um, I've seen the movie, and I do like the movie. So this that's what interested me. Just like the other game that's out, which is Paranormal Activity. Um, this this is what something I really wanted to play after I saw the trailer for it. Also, this is a VR game. I'm not going to play it in VR at this time. I might play it in the next video I do. I just want to go ahead and you know experience this game and, and see what it's like. So um, let's let's go. Let's go. Let's let's do this. Uh oh, I feel a buzzing. That's a vibration. Is that a phone? Oh, check it out. It's a phone. Okay, R2 to grab. Uh, trying to go to show or hide the phone. Okay. What was on the phone? Who was calling me? Leave me the fuck alone! Chloe. Okay, I guess, uh, I guess, uh, we're, our relationship isn't doing too well with Chloe. And she wants me to leave her the fuck alone, so. Do I have a light or anything? Pick up candlestick to illuminate your way. Okay, where is the freaking candlestick? Oh, here it is. Um, I'm gonna, oh, let's take it over to the fireplace. Yeah, light the candle on the fire, okay. Do we need to crouch? There we go. We got the candlestick going. We're doing good so far. Use the candle to light wall candles. Okay. So let's try to find some wall candles. And uh, we can light those. There we go. We got one lit. Is there another one over here? Two lit. Oh my goodness, I don't have a reflection. I'm a vampire. <laughs> All I see is the uh, the candle. I don't even see the candle in here. I just see the light. It's just a light. I'm a glowing orb. I'll push it open. Oh, oh, my phone's going off again. Hold on a second. Let me check this out. Why did you turn the power off? I hate you. Whatever. Shut up, Chloe. Uh, let's, let's light these candles on. You know, while we're going down this creepy, dark, freaking hallway, I light the candles. You know. The candles over here? Yeah, there we go. Got some candles over here. You know, I'm just waiting for that thing to just, like, I turn around and, you know, it jumps out at me and shit. I know I decided not to do this in VR right now, but, um... I do want to make another video, and I will do that in VR. Okay, L2 to focus. The story behind artist Jessica Webb Thomas. Oh, here we go. Inspiration can come from anywhere, from anything. Mine is driven by my relationship to this world and what I feel connected to. Since I was nine years old, I knew I wanted to be an artist. I was always playing with clay, but it wasn't until my teens that I found I had a true talent for sculpting, and I still love it to this day. I'm fascinated by the bonds we make as humans. The strongest bond is between mother and her baby. Oh, that's sweet. That's nice. Okay. Yeah, there's my candle. Okay, uh, let's get rid of this. All right. What do we got here? A mother and her child. I don't know who this is, but I don't know. This, I'm kind of feeling a little creepy. See, you, you guys don't know what kind of atmosphere I'm in right now. Um, you know, I'm at home. My lights are off. Oh, shit. What was that? I have all my Halloween lights and decorations up. You know, I mean, it is almost Halloween, so you better have that stuff up by now. And I definitely do, and I'm surrounded by it. So it's creating sort of a uh, very scary atmosphere. What do we got here? Department of Health and Social Services. Dear Mrs. Jessica Webb Thomas, please accept this letter as a form of agreement regarding Chloe Ann Webb. In the light of evidence provided and consent of Chloe, we are happy to inform you that we are able to arrange a trial custody period with you and your daughter. Wow. Once staging period has been agreed, we will send you a final letter of confirmation. Oh, man, some shit's been going on, huh? Okay, get rid of it. Wait, get rid of it. L1. There we go. L1. Anything in here? Don't jump out and freak me out. All right? Don't do that. Oh, I can run. Looks like I can run a little bit. Let's, uh... 
Go back down this hallway. Go back to the living room. Anything in here? No, I don't think I can open that. Oh, got a candle. There we go. I will light every candle in this freaking place. What do we got? She dumped me all those years ago, and now she just waltzes back into my life and expects me to just carry on like everything's okay? Well, it's not. I just wish she left me the fuck alone. She's trying to wow me with her fancy job and her big new house, but there's no hiding the truth. She abandoned me, and I can't stop hating her for that. We're strangers now. She's not fit to be a mother, and she'll probably just send me back to the home she wants. To the home once she's tired of me. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, um, okay, whatever. Oh, 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 I can open this door. I don't know if I want to go outside. This, whoa, whoa. The door just slammed on me? Oh, I can't open the door now. Okay, so we're, we're going to have to go this way. Damn it. What's over here? It's a deer. Sorry, there really hasn't been much of anything other than me just kind of wandering around. I wonder what that is. Look at that. That is weird. What is that? Uh oh, I hear something loud. That knock was pretty loud. What is that up there? Oh, so that's what the knocking was. It was Chloe. Uh, you're going to dump me again, aren't you, you selfish bitch? Okay, whatever, dude. Oh, where'd she go? Where'd she go? Oh, what's going on? Damn it. Can I get back inside? Nope. Where'd she go? Oh, okay. Now I can go through here. Open the gate. Let me through. Let me through. What's happening to my friend? Oh. Let me in. What is that? She... Oh. I... Yeah, that's the thing I threw on the floor. Okay. Um, what the hell is that? They're looking pretty evil. I'm gonna light my candle again. Oh my goodness, look at that. They look evil as shit. What the fuck? That's pretty bad. Oh, what's that? What's that? What's that out on the ground? Is that... Did I, did I bring... Did I track that dirt in here? Or was that someone else? Oh, look at that. She's all like... Oh, it's like some demon hands coming out at her. So everything's changing in this place. Well, let's head upstairs. I'm pretty sure that's... Oh, what, what, what's that? What's that? Something's on the ground there. All right. She was upstairs, so I'm pretty sure we need to go upstairs. Oh, there's a light behind the door. Oh, I hear some knocking. Uh-oh. No, I can't go in there yet. It's locked. See, I'm a vampire. You can't see me. It's a bedroom. This is where the magic happens. Did that door just slam shut? Oh, I'm locked in the room. No. There better not be anything... Anything supernatural in here? All right, let's read this real quick. What does it say? I had a dream last night after I was messing around with that ritual shit I found. Okay, that's never good. It was exactly a dream, more like I was reliving a memory. The scariest door appeared in front of me. It had a goat head on it, which really creeped me out. Yeah, that would creep me out too. The missing children, the ones from the news, were waiting just outside the door, and I'm shouting, 
Don't knock the door! Two loud bangs, and I wake up in a puddle of sweat. I know it was just a dream, and the Baba Yaga is nonsense, but it all felt real. Okay. Alright, this, this is freaking me out a little bit. Alright, what is this? I was a drug addict. I hate those words, but it's the truth. When I was really bad, I figured you were safer with someone else looking after you. I tried to get you back sooner. I really did. But they wouldn't let me. They said I was ready, but I'm... They said I wasn't ready. I'm ready now. I love you, Chloe. So it's probably in the mom. Yeah, sorry about my reading. Sometimes the words come on the screen pretty small. Oh, okay. Come on, grab it. There we go. Pull it open. I don't know I don't know if I want to open it. It's a walk-in closet. Oh, what was that? What was that? Oh, oh trapped him, trapped in the closet. Oh thank goodness. What's going on? What's going on? I think my phone's going off and I can hear some shit. What the fuck is going on? Is someone else here? I don't know. This is creeping me out though. Oh, the door just opened up. Oh, shit. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and leave it right here for right now. Uh, I'll get back on this game a little later. It is getting pretty good so far. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll explore more of this house much later.